As you think about planning your garden this year, think about what perennials you want to have. Especially if you're brand new to gardening and you're trying to figure out, well, what do I eat? What do I use? Get, think about perennials because they're the ones that are going to come back every year that will give you more and more fruit the more established they are. Um, some of the ones I recommend are rhubarb. If you love rhubarb pies, they're great for jams. Consider a rhubarb. They'll come back every year for you. They'll die to the ground and just come back up by themselves. Very low maintenance. Also, consider doing a honeyberry. If you like blueberries but have done a little research, you'll find out that blueberries require acidic soil and a little more upkeep. So if you're a hands-off, simple gardener like I am, I'm more interested in a honeyberry, which is supposed to be considered a superior blueberry. There are many different varieties. My favorite is the Russian varieties that um, grow five feet high, five feet wide. They are round, they're just gorgeous. And in your four to five, you would get eight to 12 pounds from one plant. So consider that in your yard. Another one to consider is strawberries. Most people love strawberries and are buying strawberries regularly from the store and a large part of probably your budget is fruit. So consider getting a strawberry that works for you. There is three different varieties. Um, there is Everbearing, Junebearing, and Day Neutral. Day Neutral keep producing till it gets cold. Junebearing have one harvest and Everbearing have two harvests during the year. Also, a new kick happening is the pine berry. They're white berries and animals don't know what to do with them. So you'll probably have even less animals and birds trying to eat your strawberries because they are white. They don't see the red, which lets them know it's a food source. So consider about your what perennials you might need based upon your needs, but those are some ones that I like and um, hopefully this helps you. Please subscribe and share this video so that more can have fun, simple gardening.